Hello, I am the Pocket Book Huntress. Welcome to my channel. So, a few days ago, I did say that I had hunted down one of my unicorn bags. The bag has now arrived and I am super excited about opening up this bag, okay? So, while I tell you a little bit of the backstory, I'm gonna start to unbox it, okay? So, I told you guys that when I was in coach, um, at the end of the semi-annual sale, when I was purchasing the, um, the, the mint syrup bags, that they had a beautiful robe in the tea rolls, okay? And I also told you that the bag had been returned. Um, a lady had returned the bag, and for whatever reason, the bag was still factory wrapped, so the store took the bag back. But I remember saying, saying to you guys, I'm going to leave those tea roses alone, okay? Because you have to stop someplace, right? But if it's meant to be, I'll have that bag. But guess what, guys? It must be meant to be because... I got that bag, right? All right, so the bag is all wrapped, wrapped very nice. Lots of bubble wrap here. Okay. Ooh. Here she is. Ah! So, even though I had to wait um, to open this bag until my little girls had finished their homework and gone to sleep, I now have right now ah! currently um, a pit bull, a wolf, and a bichon running through this house. Okay, <laughs> they are about to take over the house. So I promise you, this would be so fast. Husband, would you please control the animals? Okay, please, husband, control these animals. Thank you. All right, so back to the. Stop that, you two. Okay. All right. So, you know how your dogs get the zoomies? So, the pit bull and the wolf, they have the zoomies right now. She is so pretty. Would you look at this beautiful robe? She is beautiful. Now guys, ordinarily I would probably just start to film again because I, but I've already opened the bag and pulled the, the bag out of the box. So I have to keep on going with this because I don't know how to edit, even though the animals are running them up, okay? All right, so. Look at this beautiful robe. Oh my goodness. Look at that detail. She is gorgeous. So, this is the bag that I was talking about that I was able to find in the retail store during that time. But I didn't buy this bag from the retail store. No, I did not. Um, I was considering it, but... Um, but very, but fortunate for me, I was able to um, have some conversation with our very own Amy Elizabeth, who actually had the bag and was willing to sell the bag, and how I now have the bag in my collection, and she is absolutely gorgeous. She is stunning. So when I wore my Pro 31 last week, I did that because I wanted to um, get a feel for the size of the bag. Now she's really heavy with the tea roses on her. Beautiful 1941 hang tag. Let's pull a little bit more stuffing out of her. She is so pretty. She's gorgeous. Beautiful bag. 
beautiful. I love this beautiful, I'm not sure, um, it's some type of red. I'm not sure if it's ox blood. It looks a little bit too light to be ox blood. It looks, like, looks more like a cranberry to me. I'm not exactly sure of the exact name. So this is one of the older robes. You can tell um, just from the this um, little pocket that's in here, right here. So you can tell from here. And I do believe that the older robes, the handles don't go all the way down like they do on the robes that are currently out. So I did find this little tag on the inside of that pocket. I will just read it. So this is the Beechwood um, applique rogue. Beautiful, beautiful bag. Beautiful bag. I cannot wait to wear her. So let me tell you a little bit about how I read across Amy Elizabeth's channel. So oh, there's even, oh, she's got some other stuff in here for me too care cards and that stuff kind of stuff so it's all in here so the pandemic had just gotten started and as you guys know I am a nurse and um, our governor had shut our state down and uh, we were not supposed to go into the office so they wanted us to kind of like work from home you know if we had to see a patient see the patient and come back home this that and the other so we were trying to do that and I was like okay I'm here now what do I do <laughs> so one day as I was sitting on the couch, I was clicking through something and some kind of way I came across Amy Elizabeth's channel. And at that time, I still was, you know, on hiatus from coach. Um, but um, some kind of way, <laughs> she convinced me that maybe it was time to give them another shot. So I learned so much, you know, um, about some of the products from coach and how to find um, the coach reserve section and what that meant through Amy Elizabeth. So I'm so happy to have this robe in my collection because now I feel like I have my Amy Elizabeth robe, okay? So when I have my hang tag made, I always get a pocketbook country uh, hang tag. When I have it made, you know, I will some kind of way find a way to include Amy because this is definitely my Amy Elizabeth robe. This bag is so, so beautiful. It's so gorgeous. Now, I'm very sure that um, before the end of the week, I will be carrying this bag because I want to. I want to. Tomorrow, probably not so much tomorrow because I, you know, I'll be in the field again tomorrow. So not tomorrow, but maybe on Friday, between Friday and Monday, I will carry this bag. But she's absolutely gorgeous. I'm so happy to have this bag in my collection. She is in pristine condition. Just gorgeous. Oh my goodness. I mean, the, the detail on this bag is so pretty. And so I think that when I tend to buy bags like this, I like to have them in neutral colors um, because I want to be able to wear it with a lot of things, you know, uh, due to its price point. I want to be able to um, have a lot of choices to get my cost per wear out of it. So um, I, don't, I don't worry about cost per wear as much as I used to. Um, because when you have a collection some kind of way, you know, that kind of like goes out the window at a certain point But I do intend to put this bag to some very very good use So She is absolutely gorgeous. This is one of my unicorns now they had um, a Bag very similar to this in, in the, the, the dove gray some kind of way I missed the bag I didn't know it was on sale or whatever. So I didn't get that bag the, the black one, that was just a little bit too dark for me. Um, they did have it in like a, um, a peach tea rose color, but I just couldn't imagine why, you know, I would spend that much money for a peach bag that, you know, I already have a few peach bags. I just didn't think I would get, you know, the cost per wear out of that bag. But this one is perfect. It is perfect. Not only does it have these neutral colors, it also has some hints of, of uh, this ox blood color. And it's just so gorgeous. So pretty. I have been waiting all day to open this. Then I was waiting. Once I waited all day to open it and we got home, then I had to wait to put my little girls to bed. And some kind of way, I think I should have waited another 20 minutes because the dogs have now settled down. <laughs> 
my husband finally got control of them and now they're quiet okay thank you Jesus for that however when you deal with that many animals in, the, in one house that noise can get started in any minute if one starts to run they will all run okay so um, you guys know that Brazil is now four months old my pit bull Jetta she's three and my little Bijan um, that's Lexi um, Lexi is between 15 and 16 okay so that's the, that, that's the story of my fur babies but getting back to this bag this bag is absolutely gorgeous can't wait to wear so happy to have her in my collection she's not gonna go anywhere this bag will not be going anywhere just specifically because she came from Amy Elizabeth so because this is my Amy Elizabeth Vogue she's not going anywhere so what do you guys think you guys think she's a beauty <laughs> how can you not right all right so that's all I have for this video um, I'm so so tired or I would show you the bag I carry today I'm just so tired um, so after I finish this video I am going to sleep okay so you know um, at this point in time and at work we've got a couple people out with COVID so you know, guys, please uh, um, don't drop your guards. Don't drop your guards, okay? COVID is, make, is making a resurgence, resurgence. And right now we have um, a couple of people out. Um, we had some people out last week. Um, the hospitals are now starting to, the numbers are starting to tick up a little bit. You know, so make sure that you are protecting yourself. Make sure that you are wearing your mask. That you are that you are keeping your face covered. That you are keeping your hands washed. That you are being mindful of where you're going. That you're wiping things down. Okay, if you have little kids, the same thing. You know, um, COVID is still here. It's, it has not gone anywhere yet. COVID is still here. So please, 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 be so careful right now. Okay, so don't. This is not the time to let your guards down. This is the time to still be on high alert that COVID is still here. Okay, but getting back to this. But that's all I have for right now. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for helping me unpack my beautiful uh, um, rogue bag, my beautiful unicorn. And guess what? I couldn't help but notice that we now have 201 subscribers. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I am so pleased, okay? I'm trying to get to 1,000, but you know, you know, you have to get to 201 before you get to 1,000. So we're on the right track, okay? But if you have enjoyed this video, if I have entertained you in the least bit, okay? If I have made you smile or laugh, please, 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 please hit the subscribe button. And once you hit the subscribe button, okay, go right ahead up under that and hit that notification bell so you will be notified whenever I upload a new video. Please talk to me in the comments about this beautiful bag. Do you own a T-Rose robe? Do you want to? What color would you pick? What would you pair with? Talk to me about these things in the comment section. Give me a like, okay? So, I'm so pleased. Thank you, Amy. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I cannot thank you enough for giving me this beautiful, beautiful bag. I had no idea of when I watched your video, your, or your road collection video, that one of those bags would make it all the way <laughs> from you to me. But thank you, thank you, thank you so, so, so much. I really appreciate it. I love the bag. She is beautiful and she will be in my collection forever. Okay, thanks guys. I'll see you guys in another video. I think I have one coming tomorrow. Got a few things coming. All right, bye-bye.